Welcome to Broken News Daily, a break from your normal news. Two people in Great Britain have just completed a life-size model of the iconic World War II-era Spitfire fighter plane out of egg cartons. The model is 36 feet long and required 6,500 egg cartons, 10,000 staples, 5,000 nails, 2.5 gallons of paint, and 450 glue sticks. 450 glue sticks? That's nothing. I once used at least 500 gluing macaroni to a paper plate in kindergarten. Glue sticks are terrible. The model was built by sculptor Charlotte Austin and architect Jack Monroe and was quite challenging to build. According to Monroe, the iconic plane's complex geometry and double curved surface made it difficult to copy. To replicate this, we have used a combination of traditional timber construction techniques and advanced digital processes such as laser cutting and CNC routing. The CNC routing factory was my favorite 90s one-hit wonder. The original Spitfire was built for speed to defend against enemy bombers and was the backbone of the Royal Air Force up until the 50s. And it's most famous for its role in the Battle of Britain and that one episode of Doctor Who with Winston Churchill and those angry robots. Isn't that pretty much every episode of Doctor Who? The model Spitfire was built for March 4th, an event for the Help for Heroes Armed Forces charity. The model is currently on display at the Imperial War Museum Duxford in Cambridgeshire, which sounds like a place someone would invent if they were going to make fun of England, but I swear it's real. The model is very cool and built for a great cause, too. Plus, it's like Winston Churchill said in his most famous speech, We will fight at breakfast. We will fight them with our eggs. We shall fight with our oatmeal. We shall fight with our glue sticks. That's it for today. More broken news coming soon. Mm -hmm.